From 1880 onwards, vast numbers of Jews fled from pogroms in Russia and Lithuania. It was the biggest movement of population in Jewish history. Penniless, shattered, intensely loyal to, to Judaism, the Jews of the New Exodus spread across all of Western Europe. The hundreds who now came from Eastern Europe were Ashkenazi, with their own rite and pronunciation of Hebrew. They settled and founded their small synagogues in the best houses they could afford, in the small streets around the South Circular Road. For the first time, Dublin's Jewish centre of gravity had shifted south of the Liffey. The population grew to 5,000. Dubliners called the area Little Jerusalem. Three small synagogues are still kept open in the district. Sometimes it is difficult to assemble the quorum of ten men necessary for a service in these places of strict orthodox observance. At 7.15 every morning in St. Kevin's Parade Synagogue, a service is held. And every morning at 7.15, Aaron Steenberg prays here just as he did when he was a boy in Czechoslovakia. When I came to Dublin, already over 40 years ago, it was here in nearly in the whole district, nearly every second house, every third house was a Jewish. And they are all the Jews were living in very harmony, very nicely, for re religions, very religious, until the war broke out, you know. And after, you know, people moved away from here, they all went away to Kimmerich and to, to Neuer and Safat Estologen and into Fox Rock. You know, is is left here. That district was left absolutely empty. But all the same, I am still here. I know there's some friends, but we are still keeping the religion. We're not looking for any modern. They're only the modern people. They went away.